What's up guys, Grim here. Doing the new conquest, the Steps of Infinity. And I'm on my warrior, running with the Void Knight spec that I always link. It's a very, very good spec, and if you haven't seen it, I highly recommend you try it out. But this Warfront, well, conquest doesn't really kick off too much until a little bit later in. So we're going to go goof off a little bit. Uh, let's do some jumping around. Go to the rooftops. This is where the dream generators uh, spawn at. And usually in these corners and stuff. But a lot of times rogues will sit up here hidden so they can get to the dream generators as soon as they spawn instead of having to run up here afterwards so they try to get to them as fast as possible a lot of people will try to put uh, assassins in their raids and stuff or get the rogues to switch to assassin spec that way they can camp the dream generators because that's where a lot of this conquest is one at you usually think it's running the stones because that's the most obvious way of getting points but the dream generators are almost the main way of winning it seems because people ignore them a lot of times I'm sure as this conquest gets done more and more then it will become very apparent what you're supposed to do but right now people are still kind of confused about it and they're not running to do the dream generator shit. Pre-maids are doing it. Let's go ahead and get this fight going here. Oh yeah. Pull some of these people in and start AOEing them down. trying to get somebody pulled in there we go all right I was trying to get a target to pull somebody in I don't really want to run out in the middle of all those enemies just yet got to thin them down some and of course I'm supposed to take all the hits but if it's too many people you don't want to take that many hits it'll hurt oh yeah people getting pulled in very nicely and just keep the AOE running. Use my AOE attack and make sure I put on my shields and stuff. Uh oh. Uh oh, we're getting thinned out. Oh my gosh. Time to get out of there. Pop my big shield and... Oh. I want to help them out, but I can't. <laughs> They're just going to have to die. I want to keep taking the hits for them, you know. Whenever you're a tank, that's just ingrained in you that you're you're supposed to be up there taking the hits. But... Oh, crap. Are they going to... Uh, am I getting chased? Let's run behind something. Try to mount up back here. Line of sight them. Oh boy, enemies everywhere, look at that. Oh, the rogue action. Rogues running around trying to cap dream generators. Oh yeah, this is what I'm talking about. Uh oh. Gotta get in the mix being a VK. Get in here, silence everybody, start stripping their buffs. But I gotta keep the shields going. Gotta keep the shields going. Now that, this is a game plan by our team this time to basically stay in the fort that we're in. And eventually the enemies will start running the stones to our fort to turn them in for points. So once they start running them in, 
we go to where they're running them in, kill all of them, take their stones, and turn them in at our base to where we were... That way we don't even have to leave our base. We just get all the points by sitting here. We just kill them as they're trying to get points. It's a legit strategy, guys. Sit there and do nothing and let the enemies come to you so you can kill them all and take their stones. Mopping the floor with these guys. Some more stragglers. Clean all these guys up. Oh, looks like more of them came in. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. They failed to please the cosmic rhinoceros. And for that, they will die. So many enemies. So many enemies. Sometimes I love Conquest. Oh, more rooms pouring in. Look at them. Let's pull some of these guys in. Save me. Save me. Do not let me die, guys. Do not let me... Oh. This is where it's at. I was wondering where the fight was. Make sure to silence all these guys. Do my AoEs. Make sure to keep my shields up, go ahead and strip their buffs. Same old, same old, just keep doing it. Oh yeah. The only thing that's kind of bad on my, uh, my tanking spec here is that I don't use endurance runes. I'm all about killing players and war fronts and stuff and I I can't just change my runes around whenever I go into conquest. So my health is usually under 60,000 hit points when I play VK. Some of these guys are in the 70,000 hit point range. That's the ones that put endurance runes on all of their gear, whereas I'm putting attack power and stuff on all of my gear. Attack power, strength, all of that good stuff. Uh oh. Are my teammates up here? Am I getting heals? Do I need to retreat? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. They're pulling me back. Yeah, I'm not seeing too many of my teammates up there. Man, forget that fight. Uh oh. Reinforcements? 
Uh, it's a little more appealing now. After I get healed a little bit, that is. Let the massacre begin. And I love getting right in the middle of all these people and just AoEing, AoEing the whole area. Just hits everybody, builds up my packs, everything's good. As long as I get healed. That, that's the thing. It's, it's a lot of times you get in the middle of all those enemies and you don't get heals. A lot of times the healers are silenced or something like that and it really sucks. Let's keep pulling these people in. Man, they're just they're just getting mowed down. It's very nice. Keep me alive, guys. Keep me alive. No more enemies. Alright. Come on, you. I don't know if I should be chasing these guys around, but our guys are so spread out. Most likely there is a healer near me, hopefully. Pull you back? Where do you think you're running off to? Bring you back down to Funky Town. Uh oh. Man, this is a lot of enemies. Uh oh, I'm taking lots and lots of damage. I gotta get out of there. Gotta get out of there. Heal me up, guys. I'll pull them in. You guys heal me up. Man, there's just so many of them. Conquest matches are crazy. Gotta pop my big shield there. Oh, crap. Am I gonna make it? I made it! <laughs> Amazing, man. Amazing. Man, I was thankful for that heal right then. So I know I had some dots going on me to, you know, still. That was a stone carrier. That's more points for us. One of our guys will grab the stone and go turn it in. This is easy mode winning, guys. Easy mode. They come to you, you kill them, you take the stones and turn them in at the base that you're already at. Can't ask for a better time. Man, look at all these kills too, man. We're getting so many kills and have a tremendous lead. Look at that. We're just dominating this match. But that's how these uh, conquest matches have been going. It's like one side knows how to win, whereas the other sides all struggle to figure it out. And I guarantee it's just because of it being a new, a new conquest. People aren't familiar with it yet, so... Oh, enemies!
Man, it always sounds so brutal, all the hits that I'm taking. You just hear all the clanking of the armor a lot of the time. Uh-oh, five minutes left. Last call, guys. Last call. Five minutes left. Uh oh, incoming. They're looking to interrupt us uh, before we loot the chest, I guess. Let's go get them. Pull some of these people in. Oh yeah, one final fight. Silence, I kill you. It always gets me so nervous, man, because once, you know, going in tanking is fun, but whenever you start getting real low in health, you start worrying. Start worrying you're about to go down. And all you can ask of your teammates is to heal you up, and if you die, you know, th uh, throw a battle res onto you. But you can't always rely on that, you know. It's sometimes you don't get the heals, and if you do die, sometimes you don't get a battle res. So you're always kind of gritting your teeth whenever you see that you are getting low in health, like right now. Well, that's the win, guys. We are Gucci. Let's let these other go. Let's go ahead and see what we get here. What? Radiant Infinity Cell, guys. Radiant Infinity Cell. Look at that. Bam, another one. Very nice. Well, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. My name is Grim, and I'll see you tomorrow.